Temperature wise, we're in the mid 60s still. It was a little cooler than average today. We made it up to 68 degrees, so we're still pretty close to what we topped off at, and it's still a beautiful evening. Temperatures tonight, though, are going to be falling down back into the 40s, but most of us are in the 60s right now. We have a couple 50s up into those higher elevations. Mainly clear skies, aside from a few clouds still just lingering there. Those will dissipate as the sun sets. Any breezes we have right now, which are coming out of the north at nine miles per hour, those will die down as the sun sets and we have low humidity to go along with it. Our high today was 68 degrees. Normal is 70, so we were just two degrees below average and our low this morning was 45, so we were a few degrees below average there. We do it again tomorrow. We're going to find those temperatures back into the mid 40s for early morning temperatures, so another chilly start to the day here in town. Surrounding areas are likely down into the lower 40s. I would not be surprised if there were some isolated 30 degree, not 30 degree, 39 degree uh, readings in between some of those locations. But tomorrow we bounce back nicely. We find our temperatures back into the lower 70s in most spots. A few areas like Butler, like up into Franklin, will be stuck in the upper 60s. But temperatures pretty much like we found them today, right near average, mid 70s for the weekend. And the weekend's the interesting time period because when you get these temperature shifts, uh, usually that means you get a warm front coming in and then when they drop that usually means a cold front coming in and that tells us that there's a system. There's something working our way and that there is. So we start the weekend with increasing clouds and increasing temperatures and we finish the weekend with scattered rain. So when it comes to the weekend, uh, one day is better than the other and you can see that activity that's brewing out to our west that's sort of stuck in place right now because the stationary front associated with it but that's going to break loose and we're eventually going to get some of the clouds first working towards us now early in the morning we could have some patchy areas of fog not too much of an issue sort of like it was this morning and then when we get into the weekend this is where we start seeing clouds increasing overall Saturday is the day with the increasing clouds and most likely dry conditions. Sunday is the day where we start seeing some of that rain working into our area. So there will be some showers trying to uh, move into town. So tonight we're looking at these temperatures in the mid 40s, mostly clear skies, patchy areas of fog trying to move around there into the next seven days. Tomorrow 71, mostly sunny skies, increasing clouds for Saturday. Sunday is your best shot for rain. Monday scattered showers with temperatures in the lower 70s later next week.